Good morning, Kylie. It's Kerry again here from Pacific Toyota Lexus Cairns. Thank you very much for your phone call this morning on our 2018 Mazda CX-5 Touring all-wheel drive wagon in white and colour. So basically what I would like to do for you today, Kylie, is a high-definition virtual tour of our 2018 Mazda CX-3 Touring all-wheel drive wagon. So as you know, uh, Kylie, you're actually in Moss and we're in Cairns. You know where we are. Uh, we're actually in the city of Cairns itself at 77 Mulgrove Road. Uh, we're actually about 1.5 kilometers away from the city of Cairns. Also, as you know, that we actually have two pre-owned yard as well too at 235 Mulgrave Road, and that's about two kilometers on the left-hand side down Cairns. Next to that is our franchise dealership, Toyota and Lexus as well too, and also service and parts to behind that as well. We actually own opposite lot full drive center on Scott Street, and also Coral Motors down there on Buchan Street as well too, with Pacific Hino. So let's get straight into the vehicle itself. So as you know, Kylie, you're actually looking at this vehicle for your daughter. Um, basically what I'm gonna do is go through the vehicle itself, just go through the exterior, interior of the motor vehicle, also the features, also around the wheel arches, rims and tires, and then through the engine bay. So let's get straight down to the vehicle itself, straight to the front bar. As you can see, it's got the crystal pearl white paint with, um, you've got your sensors on the front of it, as you can see there, uh, fog lights underneath it as well. So it's in actually, like I said, it's a one owner, full box, full service history, but I'll be able to go through that with you as well too. So looking down at the front bar, you've got your front sensors on the rear, the bar looks really nice. All I noticed is that there was a little scratch here, um, but we can get that brush touch for you. Um, up onto the bonnet, just to make sure there's no bad perfections in the bonnet itself. Fantastic, Kylie. Up through the windscreen, just to make sure there's no chips or cracks in the windscreens itself. Fantastic. Looking down the left side of the vehicle on the passenger side, and just to make sure that paint's in really good condition. So I'm just gonna raise the camera down here. Just get to the rear and then I'm just gonna give you a little bit of a side shot here now just to make sure how tidy and clean that is. Fantastic, that is amazing. Looking down the side of the vehicle as well too, going through the top of the uh, roof just to make sure there is no um, bad perfections on the roof itself, just on the back rear spoiler. You can see that the lighting there in the sun, got that nice reflection on there as well too. Fantastic, the roof's in great condition. I know it's like there's a little spot up here, but we can brush touch that for you. Okay, looking around the wheel arch now, just to see how clean and tidy underneath there as well too. Checking out the tires, you've got about 98% tread on the tires. The rims itself is in great condition. There's no gutter rash on the rims. Okay, looking inside the passenger side of the door, just checking the trim out, all the nice leather on the trim is in great condition. You got your pockets here on the, on the door panel down through the kick panel as well too. Normally do get a bit of wear and tear here. There is a little couple of scuff marks, but we can fix that up for you if you, if you want to know. You can see that it protected the dash with the dash mat on there as well too, Kylie. Having a look at the uh, driver's side seat back through the passenger side seat. They're in great condition. Looking at the rear now here. So rear passenger door, checking the trim out there. Pockets in the door, down onto the kick panel and then back up through the back seat. Nice. Just having a look at that rear seat. Sorry, I'm just trying not to get the sun in there too much. Fantastic. Looking at the rear wheel arch now, just going around the wheel arch as well too, checking the tire tread on them. Like I said, it's got plenty of tread on the tires. The rims itself, I just noticed on the bottom of the rim has got like a little gutter ash there, but it's very minor. Okay, having a look at the rear bar now. So as you can see on the rear bar, it does have the rear sensors as well too. Being this model of Touring, um, you do have a few more extras as in the full leather interior seats with the velour seats through the middle of it as well. Going through the rear bar there, as you can see, in great condition. Like I said, it's got the sensors on the back of it. Nice little, there's just the dirt there. Having a look at the rear tailgate now. So just before I lift it up here, Kylie, you've got the reversing camera underneath there. Looking inside here, just checking that it's got the cargo mat as well too. So you can see that they're protecting that as well. You can see how clean and tidy underneath there. And also it's got the powerful shelf. So that flicks on to the top part up here. But you can take it off, you don't want it in there as well too. Fantastic. So looking down the uh, driver's side now, just stepping back a little bit and just giving you a bit of a, 
a look down there as well too. So I'm just gonna make my way down to the front of the vehicle. Just checking everything in paint, just to make sure that's all nice and clean and tidy. Fantastic Kylie, that looks in great condition. As you can see through the video, it gives you a really good high definition. So having a look out through the wheel arch here now, on the driver's side front, and checking the tires. You can see it's got plenty of tread on the tires. Checking the rims just to make sure there's no gutter ash on the rims. Back through to the rear wheel arch. Fantastic, and checking the tread on the tires as well again. Checking that as well to the rim. Just make sure that's all nice and tidy. And just having a look at the passenger rear door now on the driver's side. Checking the trim, got your pockets in your door, down onto your kick panel, up onto your back of your seats, and then back through the trim as well too. Sorry about that, we've got no sun coming through this side, so it's great, you can see a good view of it. Like I said, it's got the leather seats with the velour in the middle, so it's got that nice suede velour. Fantastic, it looks really nice. You can see that this vehicle's been looked after really well. Okay, Carly, coming to the driver's side. So this is the main part of your driving. As you know, the driver's side, you do get a little bit more wear and tear on this, but this is in great condition. Pockets down onto the kick panel, in through and up onto the dash, and just make my way across the dash as well too. Onto the passenger side seat, and then back through the driver's side seat as well. So just checking that driver's seat, you can see how it's all nice. There's no um, major damages or anything like that on the seats. So that's in great condition. All right, just about to jump inside the vehicle now here, Kylie. I'm gonna point the uh, camera right on the dash cluster. Just gonna start it here with a push button. So what I was saying, push button is by that button there. And uh, I'll turn the volume down a little bit, sorry about that. So it's got 76,000 and 61,000 Ks on the clock. Closing the door now. So what I'm gonna do right now, just before I go away from the steering wheel, I just wanna make sure I go around the steering wheel so if there's no bad perfections on the steering wheel itself. Fantastic, looks good. So you've got the features as your Bluetooth voice recognition, your Bluetooth underneath here, your volume controls up there. On the right side of your steering wheel, you've got your cruise control as well too. So have a look at my audio sound system is up here onto the dash. It's got that nice good feature. You put your reverse camera on, you've got that feature as well too. Okay, looking down below that as well too, it's got the nice chrome trimming around it, the dash, and looks really nice and smart. And then you've got your dual climate control on both sides, so passenger and driver's side. Also, just as adjustable, it's all climate control. Down below that there is, you've got your 12 volt plug-in, so accessory, chargeable. In the middle part, you've got two keys as well too, so it comes with two keys. Also below that, there's got all your controlling for your audio sound system and your push button. Uh, parker brake. Down there it's got your cup holders as well and inside the center console you've got your little coin box and also your another chargeable and USB and SD card as well that's actually running your sat nav. So if I close that back up and go into the audio um, just want to show you how I can get into there. Um, basically showing you this sat navigation system as well too and then as you know you've got your music switch out over there. You've got your little panels here, you can move it with your joystick. The most important thing as well too is checking the logbook. So it's got the owner's manual, it's got the manual for your navigation and also your maintenance manual book. You've got your first service there at 1000 Ks at 51 and then your next service is at 10,000, 20,000, 28,000 Ks. Also 38,000 and then get your 55 and 76 as we done the last one through Coral Motors. But fantastic. What I'm going to do right now, um, basically it just goes through the engine bay right here now, Kylie. And um, that'll actually put us to the end of the video. Um, so give me a second, let me pop this up for you. And just checking the engine bay, how clean and tidy actually underneath there is. Fantastic, Kylie. Thank you very much for your inquiry. Hopefully to do business with you. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to give me a call. But thank you very much and we'll talk soon.